producing 3,000 tons of steel a year. But very soon, demand was outstripping supply. Everybody wanted steel for their engineering, the expanding railways, the shipbuilding, the larger tugs. The problem was eventually solved in 1856, when Henry Bessemer invented a process for producing mass-produced steel. This giant machine is a Bessemer converter. It can convert 25 tons of molten iron to steel in 20 minutes. In 1855, Bessemer experimented with a vertical converter, but in 1860, he patented this, the fast-acting tilting converter. This was the breakthrough Sheffield had been waiting for. The Bessemer process could convert high phosphorus local iron ore into steel. No more need for Swedish iron. Sheffield was poised to become king of steel. The bowl is tilted down and low-grade molten pig iron is poured in through the mouth, then swung back to vertical and a blast of air is blown through the base of the converter, through the liquid metal. The low-grade iron is high in carbon and the hot air burns off the excess carbon. A spectacular 10-metre flame and fountain of gases shoot out of the mouth. When the iron is purified, the bowl is tilted down again and the newly made steel teamed or poured out into ladles and cast into ingot moulds. Bessemer steel was an engineer's dream. A material for everyday use stronger than iron. And within 20 years, Sheffield alone was producing 10,000 tonnes of Bessemer steel a week. That was a quarter of the UK output. It was used for machinery, for railways, for household goods, everything. Say 